Let's see who Jess is. The redhead and the gay squirt. The new dance. <laughs> Take two. Take two. Hi guys, welcome Hi. back to Chick Chat. The sign winner from the contest is Miss Cupcakes 101. Woo! Woo! This is adorable. I actually really like this one. I'm gonna keep it and put it in my fridge. I'm like, I was like sneak a peek. I like this. You made an owl. Good choice. Good choice. I love it. It's cute. Another episode of Chick Chat with Redhead in the game. Mm. Love it. Say another episode of Chick Chat. Chat. So we got a, another extension of Kill Mary or <sighs> from Miss Casey Katora. 604. So we are going to finish up playing that because he gave us some more odd and good choices to use. That's so excellent. we're going to, yeah, I know. What is that? Whoa. She's busty today. <laughs> <laughs> are you bleeding? What the hell is that? <laughs> No, that's my lipstick. Even though I went for a darker lip today. You have this grizzly beard. Going very on. vampy. What did I say? I was very I vampy. Shave. I was very vampy today. Yeah. I need to shave. I don't understand what you're talking no, about. No, I like when he's like unshaven, he's nicer. But when he's shaven, he comes diva. <laughs> I don't like when he's shaven because he's like mean and not mean. Bitchy. See, he's all nice and like He's welcoming. When he's a little shaven, he's like mean. He comes like this attitude. Like his, his inner layer <laughs> comes out. <laughs> like you become bitchy. You're like, I like it like this. Even though I don't like hairy. So I'm just gonna like, grow a giant no, bush on my face. No. Birds are gonna come in and out and no, grow ew. in there. That's just disgusting. like a family guy. That's disgusting. No, no, no. You can't touch it. It's a wild species. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's gross. I don't like hairy men, but Angela can pull up the small beard. Am I hairy? It's not hairy. No, but hairy Just face. Just this. They feel like pubes. <laughs> what is it supposed to feel like? They're soft though. Can't say they're hard. Do you have a conditioner on it? Yeah. You have a conditioner on your pubes? Well, what do you want? It comes off the head and it just falls there. Then I'm like, all right, might as well. Just... I've never heard of that. Yeah. Conditions his pubes. It's very soft. If Rex, you're gonna put heat protector on there. <laughs> Stop blowing it out. Like I'm gonna in. die just this red next time, so we match. Oh God. <laughs> oh God. Don't do that. <laughs> okay. Could you imagine that? The like, guy dies. It's just bright red. <laughs> like fire engine red. Like 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 mm -hmm. an upside down Santa Claus. Is that really? Like, why upside did I do that? Upside down Santa Claus. I don't know. That's weird. It's upside funny, though. Upside down Santa Claus. Yeah, upside down Santa Claus. Are we going to leave that one? We're just going to use that from now on. Upside down upside Santa down Claus. Upside down Santa Claus. <laughs> for the Kill yeah. Mary or... And I'm going first this time. And so, what is my Kill Mary or... <sighs> Ian Sumheidler. Summerholder. Sum Summerholder. Paul Weasley and Michael Sarah. Michael Sarah. Okay. I am going to kill Paul Wesley because I don't like him and I'm not my type of guy nor I don't like some of his movies and I, I don't know. I can't fall in love with his acting. But anyway, I'm going to marry Michael Sierra, Sarah, Sierra, and I'm going to Ian Summerholder, Summerholder. 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 He's cat. Cat. Okay, you're a kill, Mary Orr. Okay. Mickey Rourke. Rourke? Rourke. Rourke. Charlie Sheen and Colin Farrell. Alright, so I said I will kill Mickey. Mickey Rourke? Yes. Why? <laughs> Why? I don't remember. You don't remember? Well, you don't remember killing him? No, I don't what? remember why I said I'd kill him. Well, that's a good reason uh, to I kill said somebody. I, would, I said I would kill him. I said I would fuck young Charlie Sheen, not Charlie Sheen now. What's the difference? Same guy. No. Charlie Sheen before the drugs? 
was young and cute. Now he's like old and cracked out. I thought you like the older men. I do like older men. Like older cracked men. I do, really. <laughs> <laughs> Keeping it interesting. And Colin Farrell would be my Mary. Oh yeah, you could have it all night long. So that would be that one. You have to do the way. All night long. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, my kill Mary off. Colin Firth, Kit Harrington, or Tom Hardy. Mm. Okay, well I'm going to kill Colin, (laughs) and I'm going to Tom Hardy. Oh, good choice. And I'm going to marry Kit Harrington because he's Jon Snow of Game of Thrones. My Mm. love of the bastard of the North. And he's also leaving girls, which I'm very sad about. It's okay, he's in Game of Thrones. Yeah, but he was more naked and... You don't know that. You don't know that. Does he he have a nudie scene yet? Pretty soon. He better. He is. I love watching Game of Thrones. Good choice for that one. Oh, I love... Casey, if you like Game of Thrones, let me know. We can have a little to talk. <laughs> <laughs> this one has not gotten into it yet. I don't like it. Don't oh, the Rasha Haga, Rasha Haga. I can never say his name. Sean, what is his Russia, name? Rush. How do you say the name? Shaka Hagar. Jacques and Haga. Jacques and Haga. Jacques and Haga is my mm, my fave. The carrot. All right, so Jacques and Haga. Jacques and Haga. All right, so then there's my. So you're kill Mario. <laughs> Rowan Atkins. Atkinson? Or oh, Atkinson, not Atkins. Atkinson. It's not a diet. <laughs> Paul Giamatti, Giamatti and DJ Quails. Okay. I've so, never heard of them except for Ry- Rowan Atkinson. I said I would kill DJ Quails because he reminded me of Gollum from Lord of the Rings. Who, who, why? Because he looks like Gollum from Lord of the um, Rings. <laughs> Very creepy and skinny and no. Okay. Uh, I would marry Paul and I would fuck... Paul who? Giamatti. Giamatti, and I said I would fuck Rowan, aka Mr. Bean, because there's not really any other choice between all three of those. Rowan, Rowan At- At- Atkinson is cute. He's Mr. Bean. Oh, he'll be funny in bed. He's Mr. Bean. He'll be funny. Yeah, so look at your vagina and go, oh, like, really? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm good. I love Mr. Bean. Our next set. Okay, my kill Marioff. Fuck. Is Jack Gleason, Tom Felton, or Cameron Bright. Okay. Well, my Mary will be Cameron Bright. And my... Voltori brother, my, Jane. Oh, yeah. My fa will be Tom Felton from Harry Potter, Draco. And my kill will be Jack Gleason, Joffrey from Game of Thrones. Off with his head! What did I rate when Say I said? It. I said, young and childlike must kill. No. Off with, with his head. head! I'm gonna have his head on a stick soon. <laughs> so that's our kill Mary. Mary off. So that's done. <laughs> <laughs> Just flip it. So, so, so. So last weekend will be. Last weekend we went to who? Who do we hang out with? Oh! Red Velvet Cupcake Bitch, <laughs> a.k.a. Red Velvet Styles. I'm having her link right here. Check out her channel. She is such a fun girl. I love hanging out with her. She is another redhead here on YouTube, and she lives in our area. But yeah, I we could not get her name straight until we met her. Yeah. Literally, every time I was like, wait, what's her name? What? Red Velvet what is Cupcake it? Bitch. Red Velvet Cupcake Bitch. And now it just stuck, so... Yeah, we told her that. I love yeah. you. I, I absolutely adore you. I think you're the sweetest thing in the world. But that's going to be your new nickname. Red Velvet the Cupcake, cupcake bitch. bitch. Because it just... It's so funny and it works. But really, search for Red Velvet, Velvet cupcake. cupcake. Oh, no. No. Not Cupcake. It's Red a, Velvet Styles. Red here Velvet YouTube. Styles. I'll have her link here. Again. Bubbles. <laughs> Do it again. Red Velvet. Right here. <laughs> And I'll have it down down there, downstairs, on the description down, box. Down below. Down below. But we were just, we had so much fun. Like, we, like, hung out, like, till, like, late. Yeah. we were just talking. We got there, what time was it? Like, nine. We didn't leave until, like, two o'clock in the morning. No, later than that. Three o'clock in the morning? Three. Like, I remember it's two or three. Yeah, we had so much fun. I got to see her filming area, her room. So and I pretty. just, like... I was like, like looking at like I don't know. I was like meeting. I was like a celebrity. <laughs> I don't know. I was just like so nervous when we got in there because I'm like, oh my god, I'm seeing someone on YouTube. Like, where are we going? I was like, like starstruck. 
It was so cute though. She's like the sweetest person in the world. Guys, definitely check out the channel. Yes. Very, very down to earth. Really easy to get along with. Like, she answers everybody. So, you guys should definitely hit her up. Follow her on Twitter too. We're going to post that up there too. We had her laughing. Like, we had the chick chat humor Rumba going like, on. Like, yeah, we just had her laughing. And one time, like, I left her house, like, in pain because we laughed so hard. Especially, like, <laughs> Like his stories that he told us, like when he used to when he used to work, and the freaking stories. Stories, <laughs> like I can't. I mean, we might make that another video altogether, but I'll give you a taste of one of them <laughs> that they thought was hilarious. We had him do it over and over and over. Obviously, again. I can't get up and do it for you guys, but um, I was working, and obviously my area was to look at one of the departments and walk over there, and make sure they were good. <laughs> So, the face. I'm walking through, and all of a sudden, I see something that's just not right. So, I'm walking, and I'm just like... <laughs> She's probably laughing. Cam, if you're laughing, I know it's, you're laughing right now. It's a pair of women's panties. <laughs> now, mind you, I worked pregnant. in Babies R Us. So, apparently, pregnant women lose their damn drawers all the time because we literally watched it on camera and she's walking and as she's walking they're just going lower and lower and lower so she and like, she just kicks them kicks to the side off. and just keeps walking but graciously. the way he did it like a fairy like, like I, I had to like actually like display it for them it was hilarious oh my god we had to do it again do it again until he got like so tired he was like oh again <laughs> it was actually quite funny but though. the way he does it he like he like Swarms. Like they literally like swarm. Squirm. 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 Swarm. And then they like the underwear comes down and they just like flick it off and then just keep walking. <laughs> it wasn't even the best part. The part that I loved the most was that I had to call my manager over. But I was not picking up somebody else's damn drawers. Let's be serious. So he looks at me and he goes, Okay. I'm like, I'm not picking them up. So literally had to pick them up. Didn't even grab a regular bag. Grabbed a clear bag. So you can clearly see that there's underwear in a bag. <laughs> Leopard. Leopard, nevertheless, and walk through the store with them as the woman who lost them is still shopping around. <laughs> I can't. Yeah, we had him do that, that story quite a few times. Oh, uh, it's hilarious. Especially all the other stories he told us. There's plenty more, so maybe yes. we'll do a video of all that. If you want to do, like, hear funny stories of what we have experienced, Our retail. let us know. Let us know. And, uh, yeah, so we had pretty, we had fun. What was that? The hair on your nose. Oh, is it gone? Yes. I got rid of it. <laughs> is it your pubes? No. <laughs> <laughs> My pubes is here. No, pubes. No. Conditioned pubes. So there are no pubes down here, so we're good. Oh, Lord. You are my cousin. Ew. Girls. TMI. You gotta keep it hairless. Keep it bald, hairless. <laughs> Why are we dancing about <laughs> we're hairless We're dancing boob. about hair hairless boobs. Hairless boobs. Hairless boobs? Are you are you not sharing something? No, that's gross. Just, <laughs> she's shaving the underside? No, that's gross. There was a video on YouTube that I saw talking about retail that some lady took a, a crap. <laughs> I was like, I subscribed to someone's channel because they wanted to subscribe back or whatever. Mm. So I subscribed and he like posted a video of like a surveillance camera of a woman taking a shit in a grocery store. Like she literally like pulled down her pants, she squat and she took a poop and like walked off. Ew. Yeah, it, it's disgusting. That hasn't happened. I mean, we did have a lot of fucked up stories. Maybe we should just go into some of the stories because they are quite funny. Do you have any like, really fucked up? I feel like I'm the one who has all the stories. You, you have all the stories. All right. How about the the shitting story, the pooping in the bathroom? That kid, that that Ralph of a cupcake bitch was laughing hysterical. Or the roaches, because that shit's disgusting. Ah, oh, roaches. The, the roaches one is disgusting. All right, so literally, I worked retail for Babies R Us. I don't know if I can legally say that, but I really don't give a shit. So, whatever. I worked retail. I did returns, whatnot. So, every time I got something back, you have to open it. Because people are just nasty. So, literally, I got a box of diapers. You think it's the most harmless thing in the world. Like, they're sealed. They're brand new. Whatnot. Scratch it open. Flip up the lid. And a horde of fucking roaches just pours <laughs> out. All over my area hey, that I'm do? working. Stop it. What did you do? Stop, you're making me fucking freak out. I'm itching. So, literally, I pushed the box towards her. I was like, not taking this! Like, literally, just put... I would have ran. I ran I so fast to the office, it wasn't even funny. Because, literally, they were crawling everywhere. Now, mind you, 
there's all merchandise in the bottom of baby's clothes. So if they crawl into a baby's clothes and go back into the store, the whole store's gonna get infested. So I was literally saying to them, if you don't exterminate this shit, I'm not working. So literally, I was freaking out to the point that they literally had to send me home because of the roaches. I wouldn't work on there. My manager at the time, my friend I met, had to work on the registers, and she was literally skeeved out the entire night. I literally got there the next morning to the exterminator, spraying everything down. That's disgusting. How do people disgusting. live like that? So, people do live like that. People return nasty used freaking baby potties with the poo still in it. Really? Okay, where, where, what direction are we going to in this channel? Really, people are gross. Like, but whatever. I mean, I have tons of retail stories like that. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. That's Which one? disgusting. The potty one when they tried to poo in the urinal? Oh, I don't think we should talk about that one. That, that was that, disgusting. That one's funny, though. Yeah, well... Red Velvet Cupcake Bitch, we thought it was funny too. Oh, you loved it. That shit was funny though. Red Velvet Styled! Mm -hmm. You're not doing it. And Casey Guitar 604! Look at you smiling. We're smiling before. Why are you not smiling? Same facial expression. Why are you smiling? Why are you not smiling? I'm smiling. Casey Guitar 604. Oh, he smiles. What are you, Tyra Banks? <laughs> I shouldn't ask that because I know the answer. Of course I am. <laughs> I'm better than Tyra. Look at you. Oh, I finished Smash. So, wait, no, let's get, introduce it. Oh, Smash. So, we... We watched Smash and I finished it. I introduced it and I told it. <laughs> I can't with you. So, okay. we fi she finally got caught up with Smash. They actually almost did the season finale. Love that. Let me tell you. And um, thank you, so Ivy great. was Marilyn Monroe. But the big She's twist. She's my favorite. They're both going to Broadway. They're both going to Broadway within but the Ivy same don't know. season. Yeah, but Ivy don't know. Yeah, Ivy doesn't know. How funny was I in the bathroom scene when she goes... Spoiler alert, so if you guys don't know, oh. and we haven't caught up, sorry. Like, Spoiler alert. Avert your ears. Okay, well, spoiler alert. Fast forward. Now. Okay. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> well, anyway, in the bathroom scene when Ivy and, uh, what's her name? Oh, my God. Karen Cartwright. Karen Cartwright. I don't like her. Like She's her. not my favorite. I like Ivy. But, um, she said that. Totally different, see? I don't like her. Do you like the big bodacious one? She is. One? No, but Ivy's like down to earth and cool. She rolls with the gays. So does Karen. Karen's annoying. Karen's Karen. the producer for the other show. Karen's gay. in everyone else's freaking business. Like, uh, Karen's Sounds always like... Sounds like someone I know. Uh, no. I'm not in anyone's business. She's like a little... Oh, no. I don't like her. She's like a crybaby. Oh, uh, uh, my boyfriend don't want to be with me. Oh, the other the director won't want me no more. Oh, you told him to I can't. She's always All right. complaining. YouTube war. Pick which one you like. Put it down below. Ivy. Ivy or Karen Cartwright. Put and it down I below and Ivy judge. I think Ivy sings better than Karen Cartwright. Nope. Who had the original lead for Bombshell and decided to leave on her own accord. Talent speaks for itself. End of story. No, Ivy had it first. Then your bitch came in. And, and who she had it just stole like, it away? The, your, well, listen. Yeah, you stole it away because she slept with the director. She didn't sleep with nobody. She slept with she the director. She did not sleep like, with oh, the director. The other she did not sleep with the director. Up to the end of the episode, she still didn't sleep with him. He wanted her. See, she's a little goody two shoe. Don't like her. You're just trying to pull out any damn excuse out of your I ass. I like her. I like she her. She didn't sleep with him. I like she her. won on talent. Ivy's better. And Ivy is so much better than Karen Cartwright. Not at all. She looks like Marilyn Monroe. She Not acts at all. the best. I'll give you that one. She looked like Marilyn Monroe because she has the weight. No. Because Marilyn Monroe was thicker. I like and her. And Casey better. can back me up on that one. What? She he like he like Karen Cartwright? No, he likes Marilyn Monroe. Oh. So I know he can back me up on that and one. And he's gonna pick Ivy, right? No, you're not. A lot of people are gonna pick Ivy. No, you're not. Karen Cartwright. If you watch Smash, seriously, she's like goody goody. Leave it down below and that let she us does know. No wrong and blah 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 blah. Uh, I can't. Well, too bad my girl took over her boyfriend. Who won the race? Who took over who? She was sleeping with him. That Good. smut actually did bang him. Let's Good. be serious. Good. Let's get it. Let's bring it down to brass tacks of who spread their legs to get a roll.
haven't been watching the show, seriously, it's on Netflix, it's on Hulu, you guys can catch up and, you know, just join in the conversation later and on. And you guys will like Ivy. No, Karen Cartwright. Judge for yourselves. Don't listen to her. Don't listen to me. Judge for yourself. Block out this and listen to your, your own decision. Who's vocally more talented? Are you trying to be God? I'm not you're trying, trying to be God. You're trying to be the, the, the positive one? What am I trying to say? I'm trying to, I'm trying to give them an open gateway so we can actually judge this correctly. Okay, well, if you guys like Ivy, let us know. And if you like Karen Carr, let us know too. Thank you. I can't. Thank you. Uh, with a smile on his face, like, I'm gonna kill you and I hate you. <laughs> and the girl's like screaming and you're like, while playing Florence and the Machine and singing opera. <laughs> oh. That's what he does. He sings opera. And every time I say, like, if I'm I don't listening, if I'm listening, even when I listen to, like, in this moment, he's singing. Like, oh, and I turn around in that high school musical. Like, I'll be singing, like, raw, and he'll be, like, singing. I'll be like, and it's not High School Musical. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do it. Do the old lady. Mm -hmm. No, that's not it. You mm -hmm. <laughs> sound like Stitch. <laughs> Talking about Stitch, we have decided we're doing... A Disney edition chick chat. I don't like that way. We decided to do... A Disney edition chick chat. Yay! <laughs> so, what are we going to need? We're going to need a... Oh, Lord. A sign. Yes! <laughs> Disney, Disney edition. edition. The Disney edition. And then draw whatever character you would like. You can Art. copy and paste it. You can do whatever you want. Because I know not everyone's an artist. The park castle. Even though we liked... Miss Cupcakes 101 sign with the owl. owl. Which was absolutely adorable. I like owls and also I love penguins with a pink bow. But definitely check her out. Yes, check out her channel. Um, and something like that. So it has to be a sign. It must say Chick Chat predominantly. And then it would probably say Disney Edition. The Disney Edition. And then whatever else design you kind of want around there. So Because everything will be Disney the next video coming up. So the next video after this will be the Disney, Disney edition. edition. Oh. <laughs> oh. Nice job, Ariel. <laughs> <laughs> no, you like boobies. Mm. Wait, you gotta follow me. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you gotta follow the head. It's funny. <laughs> That's creepy. It looks weird. I don't like that. Like. <laughs> ah! I was trying to like. I was trying to like. You're gonna make me bite my tongue. Oh, that he, oh wait, you can do that. Imagine. If I would have did that, bleeding everywhere. Oh God, I don't to go with trip. blood. I said beauty. You said go, beauty, go, beauty, go. <laughs> we haven't done that in a while. A while. The, the candle. Oh, it's oh. on my side. It's a bitch. Sean, Let me tell you. What's his name again? The Lord of Whispers. The guy that looks like Angelo. What's his name? All right. Varys. Va Varys? Varys. Varys. Okay. Well, let's go talk about Game of Thrones. Okay. I don't watch the show. I do. And every okay. time this actor comes on TV, I've seen I go, once. oh my God, there's Angelo. Because the guy has his tics and his facial. I don't say he looks like him. He just has the same... Same facial, facial expression, same demeanor, same I think I know everything. Sorry. Okay. He looks like Varys from Game of Thrones. If you're a Game of Thrones fan, you know what I'm talking about. If you're not a Game of Thrones fan, find a clip. Find something on Varys. Please, guys, let me know if I really do look like this character or not because I can He can't. looks like Varys. Even though Varys is bald. But just do the... Do the... Yeah, you remind me of Varys. I can't with you. Every time Varys comes on TV, I go, oh my god, there's Angela! Angela's on TV! <clears throat> I'm just saying. At least you look someone on, like, on the TV. I don't look like any of us. Someone fat, nasty, and ugly was a villain not... who has no he's testicles. Not a he's not a villain. He's not a villain? No! He's not a villain. Apparently he has no testicles. Well, he has a religion. Thank you, because he has no damn testicles. This bitch is trying to say I got no balls. No, I... You're reading too much into it. I say you look like him. I say you resemble him. Like, not looks, but your 
demeanor, the way you present yourself, like, yeah, face right here. Like, from here up, like, he's like, oh, yeah, that's Angela. He always has an answer. I'm sorry that I'm educated. Great. He just called me dumb. It was the Jim Norton comedy show. Which I haven't got a chance to go to. You it was guys pretty, might. pretty funny. You should check out Jim Norton. He's a good, great comedian, good comedian, great comedian. He's funny. <laughs> He's mean. You're mean. The cinnamon challenge. He's mean, and he cheated, and I told Red, Vel Red Velvet Cupcake Bitch. I'm going to put the post again. Red Velvet Styles. Um, I didn't dump anything cheated. out. He cheated. Look, everyone go back and check out my cinnamon challenge. You need to see when I drop my loofah in the bathtub, he goes like this. And you see cinnamon <laughs> trickling down. Not once, but twice. Trickling it down. Was trickling. Everyone should feel sorry for me. <laughs> <laughs> and also, he has a blackmail picture of me now. Oh, it's my favorite thing in the world. It looks like I'm like, my oh. tongue is like... It's literally my favorite picture in the entire world. My tongue looks like I, I put dirt on it. My tongue tastes like burning. Yeah. And my boyfriend tells me I sound like Ralph from The Simpsons. The things I come up with. This is quite literally my no, favorite picture showing them? Oh, God. in the world. That's her choking on the cinnamon. I literally Do you know I can edit this out? It. If I, I screen capped it. I don't care. I'll tweet it out. <laughs> you see, he's evil. I'll tweet that shit. Like, evil. she cut this. This is what's in it. Okay. So, that's the end of another episode of Chick Chat with the redhead and the girl. <laughs> so, next video is going to come up. We're going to be doing the Chick Chat. The... I know you're so excited. But you have to read because if they're going to send the sign, they need to know what to write on it. Well, it's going to say Disney Edition first. Though. No. That's what I was going to say. The Disney no. edition. You said Chick Chat Disney edition. No, then the Disney edition. Because it's so important to have the the there. Yes, it sounds pr correct. Pr correct. Proper. <laughs> so we're gonna do Chick Chat the Disney. No, be a little more enthusiastic. Okay. So next week we're gonna be doing Chick Chat the Disney edition. Woo! So excited! So excited! So please send in your signs. Email us. We'll have our emails down there. And, uh, yes, we're going to have everything, oh, yes, our beautiful sign of this sign. I just love it. I'm going to be hanging it up somewhere. I'm going to have, like, a, sh like, a Chick Chat Trine. Chick Chat Trine. Can't wait to see what you guys come up with for the Disney edition. And we're so excited, super excited. Hopefully Disney will get to see this. Oh, my God, if Disney gets to see this, they'll be so uber, uber excited. Hire me, I have wonderful ideas. Hire you. I want to go there again. Hmm. I'll read you the entire park. Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> You're going to kill children's dreams. I'm not going to kill anybody's dream. I'm enhancing them. Oh, well. Everyone that wants to enhance the theme park, that would be Angela. It will be old gay-o-matic. gay, -o -matic. gay -o -matic. <laughs> I want to be a Disney Imagineer. I want to make it amazing. I just want to go. I love Disney. Well, 2014. That's the, that's the trip. Yeah, but hopefully Disney gets to see this. Yay! So, that's another edition of... Chick Chat with the Redhead and the... Okay. So, yeah, remember, guys, always follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and... Tumblr! Tumblr right here. <laughs> so, yeah, remember, guys, always subscribe to become one of my dolls in my... Dollhouse. Until next time, bye, guys.